Transparency actually um, enhances the capacity of the public to be able to have an informed discussion, all right, on fiscal policy, which is very good since it fosters accountability and the credibility of government uh, fiscal position. Fiscal transparency is important for decision making as reliable statistics, timely statistics, and accurate statistics is the foundation for any decision making. It fosters economic governance. It enables government to present the overall picture of fiscal position at any point in time, including the possible risk and the vulnerability that may occur in the medium to long term, which could help the government avert the mistakes that could possibly come as a result of the risk associated with the fiscal position. Increased transparency has, um, has led to a number of uh, benefits. First of all, I think it has changed in a positive way perceptions about our economy, perceptions about the government, about the, the public sector. Changing the perceptions has also had a positive impact on the confidence in general for our economy, state of the fiscal finances. And eventually, if we look at the data, it has led to reduction of the risk premium, which is clearly visible to the price that the government is paying on, on its borrowing. Well, uh, fiscal transparency, as you know, foster good economic governance. It ensures that the citizens get value for what they are expected to, uh, to get in terms of the use of their resources. In other words, uh, fiscal transparency enable government to actually provide their scorecard as to how the public resources utilize. Once they are transparent, it enables the general public, the legislatures, the international community, including uh, the credit agencies, uh, to know the utilization of uh, the use of uh, government resources and uh, the public can question the, the use of the resources, whether it was actually utilized properly or not. I think that fiscal transparency is extremely important for decision making. And um, the reason I, I, I think it's important is because when you are very transparent in your fiscal operations, uh, what it means is that you announce to the whole international community as to how you are recording your fiscal data, uh, as to how you are using the data to make your decisions, and as to how you are using the data to affect the lives uh, of, the, of the people of, of the country. Transparency in fiscal statistics plays an important role. When you have transparency in terms of how the money is collected and how the money is used, that will also help the taxpayers to start trusting and continue trusting in the system. So it also helps build confidence within the country as well. If you don't have the right data and not the, not the right quality of data, then you may face problem of misleading uh, results that will lead to bad decision making. And maybe some countries went to sometimes financial problems because of quality of data. So I believe uh, having a good and transparent data would give more clarity and good quality of, of decisions. Fiscal transparency, in my view, is essential for policymakers as much as for the public. It is true that uh, sometimes policymakers, they think that they, they may outsmart the markets or analysts or the public. But in the end, when uh, you don't have a, a clear picture of the status of public finances, you may end up uh, making uh, very wrong uh, decisions. We are really... Uh, uh uh, on, on the roadmap, uh, that we've agreed with, uh, uh, with, uh, other country in EAC, that transition to the GFS 2014 is also going to give a real picture in terms of, uh, information. We are publishing our, our, our data on fiscal and debt, uh, quarterly through the IMF website. 
and we've seen investors actually uh, uh, acknowledging that this is a good thing and it's helping to inform even their decision as we are integrating uh, uh, the global or the global market. Now EGDDS is done and that was also highly acclaimed by investors and now we're moving to SDDDS which is the next challenge but something that we are very very keen to move. That's why I believe this helps. This helps us to plan ahead. This helps us to convince investors and banks and others to work with us, to be credible. We first became member of the SDDS, it was in 2011, and then subsequently SDDS Plus, which was beginning of this uh, year. This has, I think, brought a lot of benefits for our uh, economy, because in principle, what does it mean? It means that we have established a better platform for better fiscal analysis. And in the same time, it meant increasing significantly transparency about the uh, fiscal finances. Mm -hmm.